This is my way kids may call me. Uh, welcome back to Mac Plus. I don't know why I kept on skipping one of my lines earlier, but let's just begin. Oh, we are currently in the cafe. She's in charge of the May Cafe. Oh. Oh. Uh, I'll help out. The transitions are way too slow, so I just went ahead and skipped it. Yukari turns the conversation towards me. Except she's still b sitting beside me. Her fur is probably against my hand. Because of that, I can't focus on what they're saying. Oh, man, till. Yeah, I always love adding a little touch here and there. Well, it's all about how you pour the milk, so it's not impossible. <laughs> That's fine, but it takes some time. I can't recommend it if you want a lot of customers. A lot of people are going to get that. If it's a, if it's a May coffee, coffee special, a lot of people are going to get it. I'm no maid. <laughs> I think Yukari is a little bit on the cuter side right now. I would definitely love to see um, an alpaca bring me a plate of coffee. <laughs> Oda comes out over after finishing the dishes. Mm, yeah, yes, quite well. The Oda takes a seat, and our meeting probably begins. ケーキについてなんですけど。はい、そのくらいあれば大丈夫だと思います。ケーキっていつも娘さんが焼いてるんでしたっけ。ああ、そうだよ。Mr. Mishikata has a daughter named Rio attending college. She, sell she helps out the cafe on the side while going to school. I began my part-time job this year at the Black Cat because she was busy job hunting. <laughs> oh, you I try imagining Yukari making a cake. I can only imagine her fur falling into the cake. The customers would probably get angry at that. Wait, that happens. <laughs> would they forgive her if she did that? <laughs> no way. There's no way they would. Actually, you can't do that in places you serve food. You, can't ju you just can't do that. Okay? I had added the just. Oh, くるま回るし、公文前で運び出しを手伝ってくれる子が何人かいれば大丈夫。Thank you're one of the first guys in a visual novel that I've heard say that. Oh, wait, is it? Hold up, I need to check something in the configurations. Um, wait, what? Okay, all the voices. Okay, I'm putting the voices on max because I can barely hear Ayaka. I can barely hear her, so I'm turning them all the way up. Whoa. Oh, okay, she was, she was still talking, I'm sorry. Oh, that's right, she still really quiet. She's how it does as she takes notes. 
心当たりがないの今度先生に相談してみようかしらあ、あやこもしかしたらうちにあるかもしれないよどういうことうちのお父さんって貿易商の人間なんだけどメイドピッチャーにあるのがあるかもしれないけど The face is well, yeah, that might be a little hard, but I thought schools have a lot of bookshelves unless, well, this takes place in the 21st century. Yeah, books are becoming more obscure. I'm really sad about that. She's not throws a conversation at me.、Uh, just me? You won't come? <laughs> What? How could she say that? It's true that I never got to meet Yukari's parents. But just wait a sec. If this alpaca's parents are alpacas too, then wouldn't it have been mistaken up until now? That would be Yukari's always been an alpaca, and my eyes have been lying to me this whole time. This might be a good chance to check. Oh. Your parents aren't home? Meaning. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> the packet moves about in confusion. Its face flushed. Every time she moves against me, her fur rubs and tickles my skin. I'm <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yukari takes my hand and drags me to the door. Oh. Mikara. So the name. So she did you. So 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 did I say my goodbye to the owners and I'm pulled away. Whoa. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Yukari looks over my hand frantically. It seems almost stupid to say at this point, but knowing now do I realize that Yukari's hands are hooves. It feels much harder than a human's hand as well. I wonder why I didn't notice anything strange about it when it was happening though. While、well, it was happening though. Whoops. Need to make sure to write this down in my observation case logs. Observation case log number 04 hand holding. The hands of the pack are hooves and are hard, quite hard when you hold them. Okay, that should be all. I think, there are, I think there will end up being a few observation case studies by Psyche Kazuma. I want you, Karin, to see him d e s i r e to the bus stop, then head home. I wonder what awaits me later. What will await you, Kazuma? I wonder what awaits me later. So, on to the next day. After finishing my shift at Black Cat, I can, I can go to investigate Izumi's sword room. I say that, but no matter how I look at this, Miss Yukari, wouldn't this be called a warehouse instead of a storage room? It's that big. It's majestic. In the rear of the Russian style main building is a structure which Yukari calls a storage room. The d a t e d plaster work speaks to his age. Yukari is flustered. I'm sort of picked up on the fact that Yukari doesn't like being treated as if she's upper class. She doesn't like saying things, it's just she has a big house. Well, that doesn't matter to me. Let's go hunting. There's a relief in Yukari's voice. She must have been worried that I, I keep crying. Man, it's dark in here though. There are small windows near the ceiling, but they don't let, enough light, let in enough light. Hey, Yukari hands me a small flashlight.、Uh, thanks. Yukari looks p u n t but you know, this place is just so damn big and dark that I have no, where, no idea where to be in. Uh, well, I wonder where to start searching. y u k a r a checks her cell phone. Can she push the small buttons with her hooves? She can. 
how she's doing that. How is she doing that? I can imagine how she does it without pressing multiple buttons at once. I feel curious, so I'm going to do something to peek down at her cell phone. What did you see Zawa say? I keep talking to fuck suspicion. You can't refuse up. Well, of course, I can't imagine anyone likes it when someone looks down at their cell phone. Forgive me, Yukari. I can't hold back my curiosity. Is that a good, hard look at our hand? My goodness! Observation case log 05. Old phone. Apaka has split hooves. Because they are pointed, they can use their tips to effectively press buttons. I really want to record this or take a picture. Something like this, maybe? Oh, yeah. We actually need to read the message. Damn it, Ayaka. Why didn't you come with this if you're gonna be home all day anyway? The noise gets the better of me and I end up complaining out loud. Uh, actually, there was no directions at all. Oh my gosh, she wants us to have sex. <laughs> That's kind of the insinuation. She's expecting us to do it. Well,. We're going with light, so let's just try finding stuff that that matches. Oops, yeah, no problem. Is there anything I shouldn't touch? <laughs> I like that little pouting face. <laughs> mm, got it. Let's meet up in about an hour then. Ikari trots upstairs after saying that. Ikari, I can see everything under your skirt. Ah! <laughs> Unfortunately, it's nothing exciting. I can only see fur. Then again, I guess it's sort of exciting. <laughs> but that's more in the sense of being fond of animals. <laughs> Good clarification. Good clarification. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the time for that. <laughs> I need to dig something up within an hour. Mm, might as well start from the corner. There are old dressers, drum cans, and books like things with Japanese style Japanese style designs that hold unknown contents. There are also western side tables, chairs, and plants, which you can only imagine were purchased recently. Actually, why would he put house plants in a warehouse? Wouldn't they wither and die? Wait, maybe these are the special kind of plants they don't wither up. Plastic? Anyway, the quality of stuff is very different compared to the storage room at my house, which is more like a shed. I suppose that's to be expected from of a tradesman. Hmm, we might be able to use this. What I find is a rather large grandfather clock. He heavy! I try to move it, but it's just too heavy. I managed to drag it to the middle of the room, but I can't imagine a girl being able- Aw, oh, that's sexist. That is super sexist, man. How would you carry bring this up to the festival? Well, she could always call me if she needed help. With that in mind, I might as well start putting things in a pile. Okay, that was a transition. One hour passes by. We gather everything usable and put it in the middle of the first floor. <laughs> the stuff I collected is mainly furniture. Yukari mostly, mostly gathers up decorations. I see. So she's letting me deal with the heavy stuff. Well, it is her house, after all. She, so she probably has a good idea where everything is. Ikari, what is this big stuffed bear? I point to the stuffed animal that was over three feet tall. Uh, hold up, hold up. I got one thing I need to show you all. <laughs> hey guys, I have a three foot bear myself. <laughs> oh man, this is, this is not my bear. This is uh, one of my family members' bears, so I have to return it. I'm currently just looking after it right now. Uh, they just brought some of their stuff over and I'm just like, watching after the stuff while they're on vacation, and this is one of the things that brought over. So yeah, I'm gonna put it back to where I found it because this is not mine. <laughs> she probably pops out her chest. Now it looks like there are two sub animals lined up in front of me. A fluffy teddy bear and a fluffy Yukari as well. <laughs> of course, I, can tell, I can't tell Yukari that. By the way, there's a stuffed cat toy that's about the same size, named Cat Companion in her room. It's a present I gave her a while ago. Cat Companion. Three foot. 
That kind of reminds me of Christy, but she's like two feet. Well, barely two feet. She's not two feet, but sometimes she can grow up to two feet. She is that big of a cat. Like when she fully stretches out, she's like two and a half feet fully stretch out my cat. So yeah, Christy's a huge cat. Yeah, sounds good. Yeah, I picked out a grandfather clock and a claw and a claw foot bathtub, but both of them are pretty heavy. Do you think he used his car? Then we need to send you our picture to check over the stuff, right? You cover takes out her cell phone and snaps a picture. After that, she taps away at the buttons, probably to send it over to see Yuzawa. I thought across this over my mind at the moment. How would Yukari look if I took a picture of her? I guess it would be a picture of an alpaca? Or would it be a female girl from my memories in the picture? I want to try this out. Why is it, what if, but what if seeing the truth in the picture traumatizes me again? I'm still, I'm still not entirely calm in the situation, so I have no idea what, how I end up if anything else happens. I'll try some other time, but not today. With that excuse in mind, I give up on taking a picture of her. Yukari finished sending the image while I was pondering that. Oops, sorry. She says... Oh, oh, that was the next line. Yukari reads out the message. Well, I guess that means mission accomplished. Yeah, that would be great. Yukari leads me to Izumi Household's living room. Would there be pictures of her in there? Ah, tired. I sound like an old man, but I really am tired, so I can't help it. I feel you, dude. Yukari smiles at me and turns on the air conditioning. It's still pretty hot for being September. And you don't live in the Midwest, it's always hot here during September. Should I help? Well, Midwest in America. Alright, I'll just do that then. I feel a bit bad about it, but I'll take her up on that for now. Yukari heads to the kitchen and begins boiling water. It's this hot, yet she's doing hot tea? I would like something cool if possible. Yukari, <laughs> I'd like something cold if possible. <laughs> Oh no, iced tea. That's what I meant to say. Oh, so that's what you're doing. Jeez, don't scare me like that. After about five minutes, you carry carries out cookies and, and a tea on a tray. Osmechi case log 06, holding a tray. I thought she would hold it with her front legs and walk on her hind legs. Instead, she only uses one front leg to carry the fray and walks in the remaining three. Well, I've learned something new about alpacas. Oh, wait, no! The Yukari Apaka is the only one who does that. Regular Apakas don't live in human societies like this! Yukari Apaka, so. Yuka Paka for short? Yuka Paka. <laughs> Yukari puts the cookies and tea on the table. Thanks. For 30 minutes or so, we have small talk. Small talk. But the only thing I can think about during that time is Yukari. It's a given that you'll think about a person when you're talking with, but what I mean is... I think about the strange mystery of an alpaca living in the human house. Even if I'm not a veteran, I'm still an alpaca lover. I'm certainly thought about raising an alpaca in my own house. But that's a dream that won't come true. On a related note, I sort of remember seeing some site that you could buy an alpaca for 1.5 million yen. I guess that's not relevant anymore, though. Is this how it feels like to live with an alpaca? If you were to ask, I'd say I'm relaxed, but how bad is just too big? She probably eats quite a lot too, so I thought about being as, the same as a sporty, fully grown man. Never mind that. Aren't her hooves scratching up the floor? I've been checking around while talking to Yukari, but I can't see anywhere that is damaged. <laughs> Yukari moves over to sit next to me. <laughs> mm. Saying that, she pushes up against me. I don't feel hot because the AC is on, but if you were outside, I definitely would. Since I'm wearing a short sleeve shirt, I can feel her arms sinking. I feel I can feel my arms sinking into her fur. Oh man, what is this fluffiness? It's too blissful. Without thinking, I pull her close on instinct. I bring my hand to her neck. It's fluffy there too. It's 
God, this fur coat feels so good. I just want to sleep in it. Man, the alpacas are the best. You can't really blush it so hard, it seems like she's gonna boil over. Oh. Oh yeah, I'm hugging Yukari right now. I'm not showing any reserve. Because she's an alpaca, but I'm certainly doing something quite bold right now, aren't I? But it feels so good. I just can't let go. Can I stay like this for a bit longer? I'll stop if you don't like it. <laughs> then... My screws are a bit tighter still. Come think of it. I just realized. I'm not picking up about <laughs> I'm not picking up any of that particular animal so that was uh, uh, that was everywhere when we were at Alpaca Kingdom. I wonder why. Is she wearing some sort of deodorant? <laughs> or something that is wrong with my eyes. <laughs> and it's obviously that you guy wouldn't have that animal smell because she's a human. <laughs> hey Yukari. Do you bathe daily? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Is he not realizing what this looks like or seems like? How about today? <laughs> Especially if you're coming. I see. So that's probably why she didn't doesn't smell. <laughs> Uh, uh, no, I, I'm just thinking that it smells like you. I was just thinking it smells like you. <laughs> I do wonder why she's so flustered, though. What's she talking about? She be okay with what I want? Want? What do I want? Hugging. Hugging Tyler. Ask if she took a bath. If that's what you want, I'll be okay with it! Ah! <laughs> I think you got it completely wrong. No, she's got it right! No, 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 not that! I take my hands off, my hands off and spring back. She loves you. Kari's shocked, but her eyes are still watery. No, it's pretty late and I need to get back home soon. It's about dinner time, too. I make out an excuse and better get by before I rush out of her house. I run away from Yukari again. Oh. Dude! Dude, you should have known you were setting yourself up! It sort of feels like I've been doing a lot of that lately. Well, oh well, it is pretty late. It's about the time when our parents would be getting home. I send a message and go home, just like that. Dude. Dude! <laughs> I... I don't know why, but I was partially expecting some weird alpaca, um, sex scene. I should not be thinking that because that's technically bestiality, so no, that is not okay. But she's a human, and she's only an alpaca in his eyes. It's better? Okay, I, I'm going to territory that I should probably get out of quickly, really quickly. I sigh deeply. Lately, I'm, whether I'm at school or work, I'm spacing out. I have over 100 cases and observation logs. Jeez, that's a lot. Yet I have still no idea what I need to do. What? You say I have too many? That's not true. There's been a lot that's happened in the past few days. It would be very helpful if you could understand. In any case, I'm, I am here in the Black Cat Cafe. Why have you done the dishes I've watched? And my mind inadvertently wonders towards the issue of Yukari being an alpaca. Kazuma-kun? Kazuma-kun? Yes, uh, what is it? He's so- Oh, I love how concerned he is. He, he, he's, a, he's a good boss. Uh, sorry. I'm sorry. I can only really apologize. I made a lot of mistakes yesterday, and the owner had to fix them up. He is a good boss, oh my god. Jeez, well, that's part of it. I'm not sure how to say it. Yes, something is. I'm sure not how to explain it. The owner's always kind and dependable. I never heard him complain. So... 
Even you have worries, boss? Have you ever had time you worried about others and not understanding you? About others not understanding you? What do you do during those times? Like, when you said when you said a vow, is there different from other people's? I'm not sure if the phenomenon of my seeing you carry as an alpaca could be all called a difference in values, but that's all I can think of. The owner folds his arms as he pops. Meaning, <笑>人によって違うだろう。とある物や物事に対して同じ価値観を持っている人はいるが、その人とを全てにおいて価値観が同じということはない。わあ、I was not expecting それを理解してあげることはできるはずだ。そうやって歩み寄っていけば、価値観が違う人間ともうまくやっていけるんじゃないかな。Compromise? Lately, I've always been passive. All I've been doing is observing you, Kari. まあ、私は今のカズマくんの悩みが何かわからないから、全くアドバイスになってないかもしれないが。That's not true. Compromise. It's important for you to act too. So then, eh? Kodo Sur Toyukotoa Nanikashira Genjo Toa Kawaru Toyukoto. The music is perfect this scene also. I really like this game. Kichito Deruka Kyoto Derukawa Wakarani. Danga Imao Kaetai to you koto de Nayande Iruno de Ariba Kodo Svikidaro. You're right. I'll try to reach more of a compromise with you, Kari. I'm not too certain, but I feel like I know what I should be doing from now on. Soka. Sorinara Yokata. Tokoro de Ashtanandaga. Musunega Yojiga Rashku. Miseni Detokorina is on and the Kazmakun. Schedule I Titari Shinaida Roka. Tomorrow. I don't believe I have anything. Sorija Moshuakinaikido. Baitoni Detemurate Moikana. Mochiron. Sugo Gawar Kiriba Kotuate Kuretemo Kekoda. Understood. I think it should be fine, but I'll check my schedule at home first. Um, there we go, there we go. That night, after dinner, when I hold myself in my room, my cell phone suddenly, suddenly start, begins ringing. I call from the car. This game does have some glitches, I just realized that. Yeah, it's me. I'm probably a bit tired from working today. No, I have to choose! Why? Tomorrow? <sighs> the owner asked me to work tomorrow. I was going to turn Yukari down, but I recall what the boss told me today. I don't think you're going to turn Yukari down, but I recall what the boss told I feel like I should be trying to find more of a compromise with Yukari. So, then tomorrow will be a perfect chance, wouldn't it? The owner said I could refuse if, I, if it didn't work for me, too. But if I don't go tomorrow, the owner has to handle that busy holiday all by himself. Damn you! Why? No! <laughs> this is the right answer! But I feel bad for Mijikata! Miji Mijitaka, not Mijikata, Mijitaka. But this is the this is the correct choice to do, I know it. I know this is the correct choice. Let's go out tomorrow. Got it. Let's go out tomorrow. Yukari's tone becomes much brighter. Has it? Would, would 11 o'clock be uh, tomorrow be good? Anywhere you want to go? Um, 
も買ってやるんだ。Whoa! For saying that she has advanced sex, it makes me wonder what she planned to do if I turned her down. Would she invite me on another day, or would she go with one of her other friends? No, wait. Maybe Yukari's invited me because she's always made, her, made up her mind about something. When that thought crosses my mind, I suddenly can't help but feel it's true. Yeah, good night. We say our goodbyes and I end the call. Come to think of it, the last time we went out for some fun was at Alpaca Kingdom. Even though we were seeing each other daily at school, we can dance with something special. For some reason, I feel calmer and breathe a sigh of relief. I'm really sorry, boss, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try to move things forward tomorrow. Oh yeah, I need contact with boss. Oh, is this you, boss? It's me, Psyche. About tomorrow. I check my schedule, and there's always some, already something. Will you be fine by yourself, boss? <laughs> He's so good. I feel so bad for blowing him off, but I know it's the correct decision that, to be with Yukari tomorrow and that in the game. It, I did the correct decision, but I feel bad about it. I'm sorry. I even said it would be fine. <laughs> Okay, and <laughs> see you next week. Looking forward to it. Good night then. My boss is really a good guy. He is. He doesn't seem annoyed in the slightest. He might turn down work. I want to repay this favor someday. I fall asleep with that thought in mind. Alright. Well! Next time, we will be. Gee! Yukari, you scared me! Well, next time, we'll be uh, going on a date with Yukari. So if you like this video, leave a like, leave a comment, and your girlfriend or boyfriend will turn into an alpaca next time. I should stop making these stupid ending cards. <laughs> okay.